Hi, I'm Paul Kasabian, I'm a structural engineer, and today we're doing columns. And the way we're going to do columns is I'm going to show you four different ones. All of them have the same area, this one being solid, the one we're starting with. And I'm going to show you how with columns what we worry about is how easy they are to buckle. So if I just gently hold the top and push down, this slender little rod is very easy to buckle, right, in terms of how columns fail. And you'll see by the fact that I'm holding it simply, it rotates as I push down on it and it buckles into a, into a shape. But I can make it harder to buckle by changing nothing other than how I hold the top and the bottom. I'm going to grab the top here, I'm not going to let it rotate as it did before, and I'm going to push down. And you can see it still buckles to the side, but I'm pushing down more than I was pushing down when I just made it easier. Now this second way, again, nothing's changed with the column, just the way I'm restraining the top. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a second one, the second of four, same rod, but now it's half the height. And if I just push gently and allow it to rotate top and bottom, that amount I have to push is the same, come back, oh, hi, is the same as what I was pushing when I was restraining the top of the double height one. And we'll go over next time as to why that is. The third one, same area, but an angle shape. Here, I'm just going to hold the top and the bottom simply. As I just push down, it's, it's harder. Same area, but being an angle, and the area being distributed in the cross section slightly differently, it still pivots into basically the same shape. It's taking more force for me to push down. And then the fourth and final one is a tube, right there. And this one, if I push down, oh my gosh, forget about it. This is, gosh, nothing is making, making this one buckle. So this, of the four that I've shown, it for, um, of the columns, has got the best resistance to buckling, all because of the choice of where to put that material in a more efficient manner. And we'll cover all the details in the next video.